Hello, it's Friday, May 4th, 2007. I'm Rebecca Field with a UPI Entertainment Update. Actor David Hasselhoff says a videotape showing him intoxicated has actually helped him. In a video obtained by Extra, he's laying on the floor shirtless while his daughter, who's filming the footage, begs him to stop drinking. Extra says he's a recovering alcoholic and asked to be filmed if he ever relapsed so he could see what he's like when drunk. Hasselhoff says he's seen the tape, which was taken three months ago, and is doing much better since it was made. And soccer star David Beckham celebrated his birthday in style. His wife Victoria Beckham reportedly took him on a big shopping spree in London in honor of his 32nd birthday on Wednesday. He apparently bought some big items like a fancy suit and a watch. After a day in the stores, he dined with three of Victoria's old Spice Girl friends, Jerry Hallowell, Emma Bunton, and Melanie Brown. And Rune 5's hit Makes Me Wonder leaped its way to number one on the Billboard Hot 100 chart. The song jumped from 64 last week to the top this week. That's an all-time record for the chart. Avril Lavigne's song Girlfriend dropped from number one last week to the second spot. And Timbaland's song Give It To Me featuring Nelly Furtado and Justin Timberlake is in the third spot. And rapper 50 Cent is putting his Connecticut mansion on the market. He's reportedly selling his 52-room estate that includes a gym, disco, and racquetball courts. In 2003, it cost him $4.1 million, but there's no word yet on how much he's asking now. Local brokers expect that price may have more than doubled with all of his renovations. The house was previously owned by Mike Tyson. And rapper Busta Rhymes has been busted by police once again. He was arrested for drunk driving in New York early Thursday morning. Police say they pulled the rapper over because his windows were too dark and then smelled alcohol in his breath. Rhymes has had several run-ins with law enforcement in the past. He's scheduled to appear in court next week for two assault charges and faces charges for driving with a suspended license. That's all for now. Go to UPI.com and check out a new special segment on our site, which will tell you how to protect yourself from police impersonators. Thanks so much for watching and have a great weekend.